Good afternoon. Bit of a change of plans today, I've done no wrapping. I ended up giving in and having a nap again. Because I just couldn't keep my eyes open, so I napped. And I completely forgot that we get new internet from them today, so I went in internet stopped. We think it stopped like late last night because I was watching YouTube and stuff last night and it was all fine. Um, but I'm having to connect. Luckily, we obviously because of living in the park, we get we're able to connect to the cloud. So obviously, I've done the vlog and everything, but it's saying that it's going to take two hours to upload. It is currently 20 to 4. We'll, we'll, we'll say 20 to 4. So this vlog is not going up on time, which is annoying because I've been doing really well in getting it up on time and stuff. So it's definitely going to be a bit late today, but I'm still hitting it, which means because of how slow the internet is and stuff, I'm now not going to be able to get my blog posts up. So, I've now missed two days because I'm not going to get my blog posts up today unless I just put three blog posts up tomorrow. I could just put three blog posts up tomorrow, I suppose. I don't know. Because I was doing so well with Blogmas and now I've had to miss, miss days because... My stupid internet. So yeah, that is what's happening right now. Um, I'm waiting for. I'm still waiting for Mum to let me know what time she's going over to Nan's. I don't think it's she yet, but uh, I might text her in a minute just to see what time. Um, just so I can sort of know what when to get ready for. But I'm going to do the wrapping tomorrow now because um, when I'm only concentrating on the washing tomorrow, and I'm going to Hoover. Um, I'm going to do the wrapping tomorrow instead because I've got plenty of time to do it tomorrow. So yeah, that is the plan. I was going to do it today but it's just been, like, it's as if it's got to the end of the week and the tiredness has just hit me. So it's like, I'm just feeling really tired and today on work was just absolutely chaotic. Absolutely chaotic. It was ridiculous. And you get, like, you get the odd couple of rude customers which is never fun like I feel like they're just like really rude and it's not like like we're just trying to do our job that that is it like we're just trying to do our job but you do get some rude customers like you get customers just badging through the aisle and stuff and you can see on their faces they're just being rude and I think sometimes they think we're deaf because they make little comments about the fact that we're in the aisles and we're taking up space in the aisles but we're not taking up space in the aisles at all it's like obviously we're in the aisle but i don't know it's just frustrating this time of year if anybody work if any of you that watch these work in retail or have worked in retail you'll like understand my pain but this week like to be fair this week has been very quiet it's not been that bad Today has been the worst day. I've got one more shift, which is tomorrow, which by the time you're watching this is today. Plus, by the time you're watching this, I will have finished work. So, I have no more work until Thursday. Um, no, yeah, Thursday. Um, but tomorrow, the advantage we have tomorrow is we go in in the morning and the store doesn't actually open until half past nine. Um, so we have the advantage that we can, fingers crossed, get it all done before any customers come in the store, which would be bloody brilliant, to be honest. But, yeah. We'll see, we'll see. But my parcel has come. I've got my new trousers. Well, I'm going to try them on, but I've got my trousers. I will show you them. But, yeah, hopefully these are going to look better than... Um, like, I'm going to keep those of the trousers because I think they're, like, fine to, like, just chill out in and stuff. Because I don't want to constantly... The one thing I don't want to be doing any now is um, just chilling in my pyjamas. I want to actually, like, joggers and, like, loungewear and stuff, I think, are just a little bit better because I feel like I'm sort of... 
I'm not just sat in my pajamas all day. Like I've got dressed, and I feel like it gives me a like as if I've got dressed for a purpose type thing. But anyway, I'm gonna try these trousers on. I'm gonna stick my phone on charge and text them. And I think actually we'll do my llama. I've said it. I think in nearly every vlog so far for the past few days or for the past week or so and I still haven't done it so we'll do that today so here are joggers number one these are actually Disney ones that actually does say Mickey on them but these are joggers number one they literally this is literally how I want my joggers like why can't I find like women's ones like these like for some reason I just can't find them but yeah so finally I have the joggers that I want so yeah so this is pair number one and here are joggers number two these ones have Miami on the leg so they look all right but yes these are literally the joggers that I like see they're a bit lower than the other ones but that's all right but my jumper is quite cropped so I probably won't wear these ones Christmas Day but these would be nice these would be nice just for chilling and stuff but these are literally the style joggers I wanted so looks like if I want to get joggers I'm gonna have to go in the men's section but I really like them but like I said these were in the sale I think these were 10 pound and then the Mickey ones were nine but yeah so it I like them I really like them so can't complain they're the style I wanted so yeah I am a happy, happy bunny. Good afternoon. So it's been a slight bit of um, a change of plan. Um, we're not sure if we're going over to Nana's now because um, Dad can't get hold of her. So um, we're not sure if we're going over there. So what I've done, I've potted around. I've got rid of like all the rubbish and stuff well i've got all the rubbish in the bag i'm not like going to get rid of it just yet because um i'm going to do the wrapping so what's call it um i can put the little bits of rubbish in there then and then i'll uh, get rid of the rubbish but yeah so i'm just pottering around because i'm going to hoover and then i'm going to start the wrapping so yeah so i'm going to do that hopefully we're going to like Dad's going to get hold of Nana and then we can go see her. Um, but I'm not sure. So I'm just going to carry on with what I need to get done. At least if I get most of it done today. Maybe I can have a chilled day tomorrow. I don't know. Because I haven't like sat and read for ages. So I might actually sit and have a bit of a read tomorrow and stuff. And yeah, I just might have a bit of a relaxing day tomorrow. Before Monday. And as well, actually, if I get most of it done today... If I then do the deep clean tomorrow, Monday would be a quite like a nice relaxing Christmas Eve to be honest. But we'll see how it goes. But for now, let's get to Hoovering and get my last minute bits of wrapping done. officially finished wrapping I'm done Christmas wrapping is done birthday wrapping is done everything is wrapped I've just organized everything for me to bring down Christmas Day at uh, Christmas Eve night so everything's organized so I know what's got to go in his stocking and all that um, so yeah I'm boiling I just want to chill out now but I've hoovered as you've seen um, all I've got left now is to actually only sort the clothes out. So I've not done too bad, to be honest. I might hoover again, though, on Monday um, before I go out. Because I think I'm just going to get the cleaning done tomorrow, to be honest. And um, I am going to do a Monday then. I'll chuck the hoover around on Monday before I go out. And then that's sorted. So that's fine. Um, I'm quite pleased with myself as to... I've got it all done like um I mean ideally I wanted it all done before Tuesday as in Tuesday 
just gone. Um, but it's all done. I'm happy. I'm organised. I know, like, what's for Christmas Day, what's for Boxing Day, who's for who, and all this. So yeah, I'm pleased. I'm happy. It's done. But now I am gonna. I mean, it is only like twenty five past five. But I'm gonna make myself a sandwich and have something to eat because I haven't really had anything to eat today. I had a couple of biscuits with a cup of tea earlier. But I think I'm going to make myself a sandwich and have something proper to eat because, well I say proper, I'm just having a sandwich, but I, I do need something to eat. So yeah, let's make a sandwich. Good evening guys. So as you've seen, I, oh gosh excuse me, I have my sandwich and stuff. And I've kind of been catching up on programmes on the TV to be honest. Because the internet is pretty slow, where we're obviously having to connect to the cloud. Upload finally went up, but uh, yeah, so I thought instead of watching some YouTube, I will catch up on some TV and stuff. So I did that. So I've just turned the TV off, turned all the Christmas lights off, because I'm going to go to bed. But first, we are going to go and do my Hatch and Grow Halama. I'm going to go and do this, because I haven't done it yet. And... Mum keeps going on that she wants to see it and I keep going on about doing it and I just keep forgetting to do it. It's only I'm going to do it. I'll be there in a minute, Poppy. She just look quiet. Oh, oh. oh, I need my charger at the living room as well. Right, stay there. But yeah, so I was turning the Christmas lights off. Oh, there we go. Right, I need to put it in a big enough glass. I think I'm going to have to put it in, oh I'll tell you what actually, put it in a jug, but I'm going to have to go for a wee first because for some reason all of a sudden I've got up and I need to have a wee. Right, now I've had a wee. Yeah, so I have a jug, so I'm going to have to do it in the jug I think, oh this jug is very dirty. I don't want to do it in a dirty one. I'll tell you what, we'll do it in Llewellyn's tankard because it's the only thing I have big enough to do it in. So, I don't know why I feel like I've got this, holding this camera very well, like, oh god. So yeah, so basically, I have a thing about llamas. I do not like them. I had a traumatising experience when I was younger where one spat at me and I forever not liked llamas. So mum seen this and thought it would be hilarious for me to have my birthday. So what do we need to do? So we need to place an egg into a container of water ensuring the egg is completely submerged. Your egg will start to break and your llama will start to hatch within 24 to 48 hours. So to ensure the water level is topped up before the egg remains submerged. When the egg is completely broken open, leave the open egg in the water and your pet llama will continue to grow to full size within five to eight days. Hmm, right, well, that's basically what we should end up with. So, let's do it. I'm gonna prop you up by here. Let's fill. So we're gonna basically put it in this because it's the only thing I have big enough that's gonna submerge it. So I'll probably like just fill it up and then I'll just fill it up and then I'll top it up if I need to. Right. So I just turn you a bit so you can see there. I keep meaning to do this and I just haven't done it, so I mean this is a really good thing. It actually feels like a proper egg. Like it literally feels like a proper egg. Look at it. <laughs> like I don't understand. We will take the sticker off because there's a sticker on it. This is literally for like three plus years. So I mean I'm pretty sure I'm safe to use it. And we'll take the sticker off. I mean, it doesn't really make a difference if I leave the sticker on, but we'll do it. Right, so that's that, and then we just put it in the water. Oh, it just about fits in the tankard. Oh, that's going to push. Right, okay, I'm going to have to. Is it going to sink? Are you sinking? Oh, it's sinking. I feel like it's going to tip water everywhere. I feel like I've put too much water in. Oh, 
is it? <laughs> just slowly submerging. Oh, maybe it's not going to tip the water, the, the water right. I was a bit worried it was going to like tip the water right. <laughs> oh no, it hasn't. Oh well. Nearly there. Oh, is it not? <laughs> Can we not go any further? Right, okay, I'm gonna have to put some water on the top of that. Right, okay. Because it needs to be completely submerged. Okay, well. There we have it. Stage one is complete. Oh god. Well guys, I've had a little look through social media and stuff and just kind of chilled out for a little bit. For about like ten, fifteen minutes. But now it is time to curl up and go to sleep. It's the last shift tomorrow. I am like I can't believe how quick this week has gone to be honest like I can't believe it is the last shift and then it's basically Christmas I just can't believe it but yeah so I'm all wrapped up in my Christmas bedding Poppy is chilling over there so she's all curled up and cute and sleeping and yeah I'm just going to get cosy now and go to sleep I'm actually feeling quite tired though so yeah, we didn't end up going over uh, my nan's after because um, she'd gone out shopping so we didn't end up going over there this afternoon so we're going to go over there tomorrow afternoon instead. Uh, so it's not too bad because like I said I've hovered now today, I've finished the Christmas wrapping and I've finished Lamar's birthday wrapping and Yeah, that's it, I've done it. Yeah. So yeah, I've done all that to do. So tomorrow now I've only gotta work my way like sort the washing out in the basket to put away and just work my way through the washing tomorrow. So that makes my life a bit easier. And I'm probably just gonna do the cleaning tomorrow as well instead of Monday. And then just chuck the hoover around on Monday. So I think that won't be it won't be too bad. So yeah. No see how tomorrow goes but for now we're gonna get comfy oh god i go to sleep and i will see you guys tomorrow and we'll see how my lamb is doing as well tomorrow so yeah good night